my name is Holly. Welcome back to my channel. Sorry if it's a little loud in here. I have our little electric fireplace going because it is freezing in Alabama. So this video is going to be almost like some days in my life. It's not one full day. Today is actually Tuesday and my mother-in-law, Miss Althea, and I went to one of my favorite little antique shops, Prattville Pickers. You've been there before with Kayla and I. We're going to go there today. I'm going to be actually get to meet one of the owners of the booth that I absolutely love and I've shared it before. Her name is Lori and I'll link her Instagram account down below so you can follow her. She has the cutest stuff in the most cutest booth. I've been talking with her and actually I'm going to be able to meet her and her husband today. I'm not going to ask them to be on YouTube because I don't really know how people feel about that if they're comfortable or not, but you can definitely go meet her over there on her account. But I contacted her because I'm looking for a few new pieces for our living room to kind of spruce it up for the new year. And so I'm meeting with her and I'm super Super excited there's already a few pieces that I have already saw on her Instagram account that's in her booth that I want to get so I'm gonna kind of just show y'all around there and then we're gonna come home kind of put some things out I'm sure I'll probably have to paint some things and I don't really know um, it's basically gonna be like a video that's gonna be let's get ready for our winter home tour and it's gonna be actually a collab with my friend Miranda and a new youtuber her name is Melody and she has a really cute thing so y'all be on the lookout for that video Friday now if I'm looking at myself I see my neck so I wanted to point out a couple of things that my mother-in-law got me for Christmas this year because I love it. Some new jewelry pieces. So I'm going to share these with y'all. And then um, I'll try to link where she got them. Um, I need to ask her if she remembers. Anyways, I'm going to show y'all those real quick. And then we're going to go out about shopping at home and start decorating our house for winter. I wanted to share with y'all these bracelets. They're so cute. They're just like little beaded bracelets like what we used to do in middle school. But this one, she got it to say simply Lake and Lace. And then this other one, she got it to say Drew Boo. Y'all know my husband, Drew. We all have been calling him Drew Boo for I don't know how long now. So, Simply Lake and Lace and Drew Boo. And then also, she got me this ring. Okay, I think it was showing backwards. So, I'll show it to y'all this way. But as you see, this one says Simply Lake and Lace. And then this one says Drew Boo. And then she also got me this ring that I love. And it says Drew. And I think it is so pretty. I've been wearing it like in the shower and everything. And it has not turned my finger green. And my fingers turn green pretty easy with like costume jewelry. And so this one I don't believe is real gold. Like I said, I'll try to get the link for y'all. But you can get it custom to say anything that you want. And I just thought it was so pretty. And then if y'all remember, I got this necklace at one of my local boutiques. And it's got the D in it. So I'm representing my husband with all my jewelry pieces now. And I was like, I want to share with y'all my new little jewelry pieces that I'm absolutely loving right now. Okay, let's go shopping. that I got for our living room and I'm so excited Miss Althea found it for me it's this blue color and it is a pretty blue but I'm just over this turquoise blue so I am painting it this green color because I've been wanting a piece of furniture green so I hope this turns out a pretty color I got it at Home Depot it is called what's it called Laurel Garland there we go Laurel Garland and I'm hoping that it's gonna look good, which I think that it is. And I love this um, wood top, and the knobs are gonna be so pretty, I think. And then look, it pulls out so Drew can set his drinks and his um, food on it. So nice. It's a super heavy piece, though. Really heavy. Drew and I were struggling getting it in. Me, way more than him. But anyway, so we are about to paint this piece green. I love it. So I bought this cabinet today thinking I was going to paint it white and it was going to go in the place of this. Well, <laughs> it doesn't fit and I'm almost really in tears. So 
I said I'm thinking about putting this over here and putting a wreath on it and then putting the new cabinet up here, still painting it white, but I'm keeping the, this is not old by the way, so don't freak out. So painting this white, but keeping this, this color, cause I think that'd be really pretty over here. And Drew said, no, put it on that wall and bring this piece in the bathroom. But I think that piece is gonna be too small for the bathroom. So we're about to go play around with some stuff and see what to do because he won't make it fit. And then I also grabbed this from her little store, or from her, her little booth. I grabbed this one because it was a Happy New Year's card. It was $3. This is where I got my Christmas one too. And I got this one because I thought it'd be really pretty for Valentine's Day and for spring. So I'm gonna put this one up now. So it is a Monday morning and I am painting the shelf that I got from Prattville Pickers. It has these beautiful doors on it. It was black and I loved it black, but it, it needed to be white for where I needed to put it. So Drew started painting it for me and it needed to dry some. And so I decided to go ahead and finish it up. He told me he would do it for me today to finish it up, but I'm just ready to get it finished and then put in the bathroom where I'm planning on putting it. And I have my diffusers going. And then I'm thinking about getting this going today because it's so cold today. Here in Alabama, it's snow in most places. So I'm thinking about having the house all warm and cozy. So getting this going. And I did have my massage today. I go monthly to have a massage by a local friend of mine. Her name is Ruth Coker and she is amazing. She uses Young Women Essential Oils. So I had that done this morning. Got home, gonna start painting, piddling around in the house. And I'm gonna make me some coffee today. We'll talk about this new setup later in my winter home tour, but I think I'm gonna make my coffee in this Let It Snow mug because they kept saying there was a possibility it could start snowing here. So I thought this mug suited for today. So I put all of this into this cute little pot that I got from Rustic Relics and this was a gift, a little Christmas gift from our cousin Carla and it is the sweetest little gift. I love it. I want to get some more of this kind of stuff through the season. I mean, I have my diffusers going, but I just love something that's simmering on the stove too. So, and so since I'm home today, it's definitely going to warm up the home and give me those warm winter feels. So we'll get that kind of going. It has the orange, cranberries, rosemary, um, cinnamon, and cloves. So thank you, Carla. I guess I'm going to show y'all some sneak peeks on what I'm planning on doing uh, to change up the house and then uh, what to expect for our winter home tour. So if you've been following me for a while, I feel like ever since probably around summertime, I've been looking for the perfect shelf for this space. The only one that I have found perfectly is this one or that fits perfect and somewhat what I wanted. I wanted, I didn't want all that scrolly stuff. It's very French country to me and I just didn't want that vibe over there. I wanted like a just very shabby chic shelf over there and so i thought i was going to get drew to build me one and i couldn't find one so i found this shelf at prattville pickers and i was so excited i was like that's gonna be perfect here y'all i get it home it does not fit there's a holy one did you not measure it i was like i don't know i just thought that that was it so i was so excited so here's the new game plan i am done trying to look for a shelf over here so my plan is to hang it over here I used to have this hanging up here. I've had it ever since we've moved into the house, but I think the cabinet's gonna be beautiful there. We're gonna hang it down a little bit lower and I wanted to paint it white so it kind of blended in with everything and because there, there was already a black shelf there. So I think the white is gonna be beautiful and then I'm gonna put some of these types of things in it, like the oils that I like using. I'm just gonna make it look like a very awesome little spa cabinet. And so I'm excited about that. And then I possibly am gonna be moving my Aria diffuser over here to this corner and changing that up some a little bit because I really want my Aria beside my bathtub and uh, then just have all the little spa, like my bath bombs and stuff there. Um, all of my stuff comes from Young Living. Y'all know that. I just, if you're new to my channel, I want y'all to know I do not use like any synthetic fragrances or anything um, in the bath with me because very harmful for your body. And so I use like these from Young Living that are like all natural, actually help benefit my body. So I'm not soaking in a toxic bathtub. So I'm gonna put all of those little essentials in there. And I'm so excited to get that hung up. And then over here, I have this little piece that used to be there. Um, if y'all remember it, it's just a wooden piece. And then it has a sign that came from Magnolia 
market it says grow old along with me the best jet to be and then i put a cotton wreath on it so i'm either going to put that back there or or i may even put this up there if it's wide enough to change it up a little bit that may be what i do i'm not quite sure i do love that little grow old with me the best jet to be sign but I don't know, we'll see. Either that's gonna go back up there with a wreath or this is gonna go back up there with a wreath. So stay tuned for my home tour to see how that turns out. I don't know, I just feel like there's a lot going on over here. I feel like I moved the Aria diffuser over this way and then I take all of that stuff down, put it in this cabinet over here with the doors and just put something simple over there. I think that I will just like it a lot better. And then I'm gonna give y'all another little sneaky sneak. I'm not gonna show you all of it. Uh, this new table that I got and I love that it pulls out like this. Need to clean it up some. Take some lemon essential oils of that. It'll probably get that paint right off. So it pulls all the way out. I am so excited about this piece. I cannot wait to share with y'all. It's change that we have done over these last couple of weeks to kind of spruce things up and give y'all new ideas for this new year and this new season. I am so excited. It dried, so I got to flip it over and now I'm painting the coat on the bottom shelves and then i'm going to try to screw the doors back on and it will be completed so i'll show y'all what it looks like completed um i don't think i'm going to show y'all what it looks like hung up today though because i want to leave some surprises for the home tour video okay the cabinet is done i have put the doors back on it i'm about to take it into our bedroom i don't think i'm going to hang it up because i don't want it to fall off the wall so i'm just going to sit it in front of the wall that i want it to go on and whenever drew gets home in a couple of hours he will be able to hang it up for me i'm going to show y'all something else that i got from prattville pickers i've been wanting one of these for a while and kayla friday had one in her house and it was super cute and i think miranda had them i just never knew that i had I just never knew that I had a place to put it. And now I have done some rearranging and I have the perfect place for it. And I'm super excited about it. I'm gonna be able to hang my aprons on it and I'm not gonna share with y'all that. So be on the lookout for my winter home tour to see where I end up putting this. I got it for like $12. I got it from Lori's booth. Also this piece I got from her booth and then also those little cards. Okay, I couldn't wait to show y'all. So I'm not gonna show y'all how I decorate it and what I'm doing with it. But I wanted to show y'all because Drew got it up and it is so beautiful. I cannot wait to decorate this and put all of our oils in it. And then work on this area behind me and get the shelf down and make it clean and tidy looking. Okay, I hope that y'all enjoyed this video with me today and getting all the little sneak peeks before I share our winter home tour with you all on Friday. And that is a collab with some of my friends. Don't forget to check out the description box down below. That is where I'll have everything linked, including Lori's page. If you want to give her a follow, don't forget to say hello to her and that I sent you. And you'll be able to grab all the ideas on how to decorate beautifully with all of these little antique pieces that you find out and about. I hope that y'all are having a wonderful January and start to year 2021. And I cannot wait to share more videos with y'all throughout the rest of the winter season. And the next will be Valentine's Day and then spring and then summer. I love like every season. It's always so exciting. To, I love some change. I need change in my life. Again, thank you all for being here with me and thank y'all for watching this video. I hope that it all inspired you. Hopefully made you want to get out and flip some pieces, make them your own and bring new pieces into your home to kind of change things up and give you like a new cozy home feel. If you're new to my channel and this video to watch, I hope that you enjoyed it and loved it and want to check out some more day-to-day -day in the lives with me and some of my other home tours please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and y'all don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and then also comment down below what is your most favorite piece that you saw that i got or maybe something that caught your eye in Lori's booth anyway i hope that y'all have an amazing rest of your week and i will see y'all on friday bye y'all